There are likely some serious conversations happening around dinner tables throughout Santa Fe tonight. Parents talking to their children about the consequences of making school threats. This after a threat was made against a teacher at Santa Fe High School. The student accused of making the threat has been arrested and is facing charges. Channel 2's Roseanne Aragon live on that campus, which as we know was the site of a deadly shooting rampage in May. Roseanne? Parents and grandparents tell me this is the last thing this community needed. School officials say that student has since been removed from campus, but the families here are looking for potential solutions to the violence. It's scary. It's scary. What's going to come over these kids? An unwelcome situation in a town with hearts still healing. You know, adds on to the anxiety and everything and gets everybody on edge. Because just four months after the devastating school shooting, another threat, this time to a teacher. Santa Fe ISD school officials say Monday afternoon, a student made a verbal threat directly to a teacher. The 16-year-old was arrested and has been removed from the campus. Me going to Santa Fe ISD school, it's just like, I would never think the halls that I walked in, that would happen. Haley Meyer's six-year-old daughter will eventually be another generation of her family going to Santa Fe High, but... It makes you worried. You shouldn't have to feel that way whenever you send your kid to school. The district sent a letter to parents saying, due to federal and state privacy laws, information regarding student records is prohibited, which includes disciplinary actions. As a result, we are not able to discuss the details of the threat or the consequences for this particular student. However, appropriate discipline was applied according to the student code of conduct. Now parents are pushing other parents to talk to their children. Everybody says my kid's fine. My kid's fine. Okay, really? For now. I think they did the right thing by arresting him. It's maybe it'll send a message to the other kids. Now that student was charged for making a terroristic threat to a public servant. This case will be heard by the juvenile court. Reporting live from Santa Fe, Roseanne Aragon, KPRC, Channel 2 News.